This is the Cambridge English Starters Listening Test Six. Part one. Look at part one. Now look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Look at this photo, Mr. Gray. This is my room, and these are my friends and my brother Dan. Who's your brother? He's standing on the bed. I can see Dan now. He's wearing a blue coat. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. One. That's a beautiful dog. Who's the girl next to it? Her name's Grace, and she's very nice. She likes pink shoes. Me too. Two, and this is Ben. He's next to a toy lorry. Okay, I can see him now. Ben has got lots of hats. Yes, he's wearing a brown hat in the photo. Three, who's that boy? He's holding a robot. Is he wearing a hat? Yes. He's wearing a grey hat. His name's Hugo. Hugo likes robots and cars. Four. Who's the boy in the yellow jacket? That's Sam. His foot's on a ball. Does Sam like football? Yes, football is his favourite hobby. Five, and who's the girl in the blue dress? Her name's Eva. Eva's wearing pink shoes too. Yes, that's right. Now listen to part one again. One, that's a beautiful dog. Who's the girl next to it? Her name's Grace, and she's very nice. She likes pink shoes. Me too. Two. And this is Ben. He's next to a toy lorry. Okay, I can see him now. Ben has got lots of hats. Yes, he's wearing a brown hat in the photo. Three. Who's that boy? He's holding a robot. Is he wearing a hat? Yes, he's wearing a grey hat. His name's Hugo. Hugo likes robots and cars. Four. Who's the boy in the yellow jacket? That's Sam. His foot's on a ball. Does Sam like football? Yes, football is his favourite hobby. Five, and who's the girl in the blue dress? Her name's Eva. Eva's wearing pink shoes too. Yes, that's right. That is the end of part one. Part two. Look at the picture. Listen and write a name or a number. There are two examples. Hello. Hello. I want some pencils for my school, please. Okay. What's the name of your school? It's Flower Street School. 
F L O W E R. That's right, Flower Street School. How many pencils do you want? Fifteen, please. Fifteen? That's a lot of pencils. They're for my class. Can you see the answers? Now you listen and write a name or number. One. Do you want rubbers? Yes, please. Can I have twelve rubbers, please? Twelve. Yes, please. Two. And I'd like six rulers, please. Okay. Do you want long rulers? Yes, six long rulers, please. Here you are. Three. And which class are you in? I'm in class seven. Class seven. Oh, children have a lot of things to learn in this class. Yes, but I like my class. I have a lot of friends. Well done. Four. And what's your teacher's name? Her name's Miss Green. G R E E N. What a nice name! Yes, my classmates like Miss Green. Five. And what's your name? I'm Alex. That's A L E X. Thank you, Alex. Goodbye. Now listen to part two again. One. Do you want rubbers? Yes, please. Can I have twelve rubbers, please? Twelve. Yes, please. Two. And I'd like six rulers, please. Okay. Do you want long rulers? Yes, six long rulers, please. Here you are. Three. And which class are you in? I'm in class seven. Class seven? Oh, children have a lot of things to learn in this class. Yes, but I like my class. I have a lot of friends. Well done. Four. And what's your teacher's name? Her name's Miss Green. G R E E N. What a nice name! Yes, my classmates like Miss Green. Five. And what's your name? I'm Alex. That's A L E X. Thank you, Alex. Goodbye. That is the end of part two. Part three. Look at the pictures. Now listen and look. There is one example. How is Ben going to his grandma's house? Where's Ben? He's going to his grandma's house. By bus or by train? Well, he's riding his bike. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. What's Anna's dinner today? Mum, what's for dinner today? 
It's fish and chips, Anna. Can I have some peas too? Yes, you can. Two. Where's the cat? Is the cat playing in the garden? No, it's in the house. Is it in the living room? No, it's in the bedroom. It's sleeping under the bed. Three. What does Nick want for his birthday? What would you like for your birthday, Nick? Would you like a new camera or a new radio? But I have a camera and a radio. I want a new computer. Okay, you can have a new computer for your birthday then. Fantastic! Thanks. Four. What sport does Sam like playing? Which is your favourite sport, Sam? Football. No, it's not football. Is it tennis? My sister likes tennis, but my favourite sport is hockey. Five. Where is Lucy's new doll? Why are you sad, Lucy? I can't find my new doll. Is it in the box, or is it on the bookcase? No, it isn't. Oh, I can see it now. It's behind the chair. Now listen to part three again. One. What's Anna's dinner today? Mum, what's for dinner today? It's fish and chips, Anna. Can I have some peas too? Yes, you can. Two. Where's the cat? Is the cat playing in the garden? No, it's in the house. Is it in the living room? No, it's in the bedroom. It's sleeping under the bed. Three. What does Nick want for his birthday? What would you like for your birthday, Nick? Would you like a new camera or a new radio? But I have a camera and a radio. I want a new computer. Okay. You can have a new computer for your birthday then. Fantastic. Thanks. Four. What sport does Sam like playing? Which is your favourite sport, Sam? Football. No, it's not football. Is it tennis? My sister likes tennis, but my favourite sport is hockey. Five. Where is Lucy's new doll? Why are you sad, Lucy? I can't find my new doll. Is it in the box, or is it on the bookcase? No, it isn't. Oh, I can see it now. It's behind the chair. That is the end of part three. Part four. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Can you see the monkey on the tree? Yes, I can. Right. Now colour it brown. Pardon? Colour the monkey on the tree brown. Can you see the brown monkey on the tree? This is an example. Now you listen and colour. One. Now find the monkey on the chair. Okay, I see it now. 
It's sitting on the chair. Can you colour that monkey orange? Orange. That's right. Two. Look at the monkey under the tree. Okay, I can see it. Can I colour it? Yes. Colour it black. Okay, a black monkey under the tree. Three. Now colour the monkey behind the cat. The monkey behind the cat? OK. You can choose the colour. Red. I love that colour. Yes. Red's a nice colour. Four. Look, there's a monkey in front of the flowers. Yes, there is. Colour it grey. A grey monkey in front of the flowers. Yes, that's nice. Five. Can you see the monkey between the boys? Yes, it's eating a banana. Colour this monkey green. A green monkey between the boys? That's right. Well done. The picture looks good now. Now listen to part four again. One. Now find the monkey on the chair. OK, I see it now. It's sitting on the chair. Can you colour that monkey orange? Orange? That's right. Two. Look at the monkey under the tree. OK, I can see it. Can I colour it? Yes. Colour it black. OK, a black monkey under the tree. Three. Now colour the monkey behind the cat. The monkey behind the cat? OK. You can choose the colour. Red. I love that colour. Yes. Red's a nice colour. Four. Look, there's a monkey in front of the flowers. Yes, there is. Colour it grey. A grey monkey in front of the flowers. Yes, that's nice. Five. Can you see the monkey between the boys? Yes, it's eating a banana. Colour this monkey green. A green monkey between the boys. That's right. Well done. The picture looks good now. That is the end of the Starters Listening Test 6.